We've just got on board our boat for the next seven nights. We're doing a Sail Croatia Explorer cruise around the islands of Croatia. And today we, we want to take you along as we discover what this boat looks like because it is so fresh. We've been looking forward to this and talking about it for so long. Yeah, we have been. And the reason that we decided to, well, the reason we picked this one was because it's a new boat, you get your own ensuite, um, and we're a little bit older, so yeah. that's the kind of vibe that we're into. So we're going with Sail Croatia. When, when, for us, when we hear Sail Croatia, we think about the Navigator Cruise, which is traditionally like the party one that they offer. But we were stoked to find out recently they also have We've got heaps of actually heaps of yeah, other tours do. so they've got one which is for the young professionals which we'd like to think that we are <laughs> it's called the explorer and like yeah. they said yeah you've got your own bathroom and everything newer yeah. boat not quite as much about the party vibe but you still get to see all the same stuff and with people that are sort of like-minded so yeah it's a good combination for us it seems like the best combination so we are like we are just camping if you want to find out more about which all of the other different tours and stuff that um, Sail Croatia offer because I'm sure people are going to ask and be curious just like we were um, I'll put the links below but now we're literally walking on the dock it's 10 30 they said that we could check in at 10 30 between 10 30 and 12 and we're like on the dock <laughs> we're here early. let us on we're ready let's go <laughs> So nice and cool in here. Babe, what? Jackpot! <laughs> I'm so excited! This room is huge. This bed is so puffy. Everything smells new and fresh. It's like a hotel suite. Like yeah, the chair is. and the desk. Those don't belong on boats, do they? That's like, this is beautiful. And we've got air conditioning. And that is vital. It's really nice and cool in here. Heaps of space. A what? A TV? A TV behind you. Oh my god, there's two. A big wardrobe too. Okay, where's the bath? The bathroom must be through here. Oh my gosh, this is massive too. Really? <laughs> There's a full on shower, like a normal shower. This honestly feels like a hotel room. I'm even more excited now to know that this is where we're going to be for seven nights. We have to do a proper tour around. Yeah, I the boat looks so fresh because apparently it only did its maiden voyage about a week ago. I know, how cool is so that? So there might have only been, or maybe two weeks now, so there might have been two trips, two different people that have been here. You can tell here. because everything is pristine. Fresh to death. So the first place we've come to is up to the bow. We must be on about the middle deck now because I think there's a sun deck up there. All fresh, even the chain and the anchor and everything looks real nice. Let's head down the side and we'll see what we can find. So the bridge is right here. This is. This is where the captain is uh, taking taking charge. So bow there, bridge there, coming down on the sun deck. That goes down to the lower deck, which is where we got on from the dock side. We're going to head to the aft here, which we think is where the uh, eating area and the main salon, the main saloon is. Ooh, is this where we have breakfast? It must be. Lunch? Yeah. Wow, this is cool. And then the saloon, main saloon, isn't there? That is fancy. Just in the saloon, yeah. I believe you call it, and on this cruise there's 37 people. We just saw the place settings, all the knives and forks, um, and that is where we get breakfast and a three course lunch included too. Let's go! Yeah. Yo, was that a hot tub? Yo, that's a hot tub. <laughs> <laughs> what? What? I didn't get the memo about the hot tub. <laughs> wow. Okay, so we've got there's a lot of space up here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's lots of space. There's music playing as well. We're trying to find places off to the side that we can record of so that we can uh, not pick up the audio. Okay, so there's lounges here, hot tub here. We are going to spend a lot of time up here, I think. Right, 
So the main saloon, main salon behind us. The stairs that we went and were up that way up to the sun deck. We don't actually know the names exactly, we're just guessing about that. Seems about right. Coming back downstairs now to the yard. This looks like another hangout spot. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> There's your swim toys. <laughs> this one looks like the winner. Drink holder, comfortable water coming through from the underside as well. You have to put your name on that one. <laughs> <laughs> we'll claim it. So that guy that just said hello that was sitting right here, that's Antonio. I think he is, I've seen his name on a few things. I get the feeling he might be in charge. He was playing it, he was playing it off cool, but he's just told us that we're heading now, uh, well, so we're waiting for a couple more guests, then we're gonna have lunch on board, then we set sail and we're going to get some, uh, some gas, some diesel I'm assuming, around to a port where we can start swimming. You good? All, yeah, almost underway. That's the bit I'm looking forward to. Once you first start sailing and then you're like, yes, you can see the, the wake off the back. I'm here for you, so 24-7, anytime. Don't, don't hesitate. Don't hesitate to ask me anything. Wake me up anytime in the night. Okay. I'm here for you guys. Why don't you It has begun! It's happening! <laughs> we are underway now. Just we're, leaving the port. And we've just been sitting down, so we've had our entree and some bread served. And a shot of something. Oh yeah, some sort of a welcome shot. And, and a drink. And a briefing and the safety stuff. So all of the like, the logistics the and admin. the admin stuff is out of the way. And now, yeah, we're, so we're underway. We've still got, so we have three course lunch. I'm not sure what we're going to get for our main. And then apparently there's a dessert and then coffees and stuff as well. We are living the dream oh. up here. It's so good. It's so good to be underway. I love it. And this is honestly, we've really hit the jackpot with this boat. It is new and so nice. And everybody downstairs, it's good because there's 40 people and there's eight tables. So you're sort of shared. We've already made friends with some uh, two groups, or three groups of couples actually. Yeah. And everyone is just in such good spirits as we are. Sorry if these come across really excited and stuff, but. Yeah, apologies, <laughs> but we are excited. It's just awesome. Everybody wants to come to Croatia and do a cruise. So our lunch, we've it's been delivered. This is pork and it is so, um, so tender as well. And we've got a risotto there as well. It is classy. It's a lot fancier than we sort of expected. <laughs> So that was a delicious dessert as well. I think with some sort of coffee and cream flavor. We've just been about uh, 30 minutes or so in this little bay here. Some people went for a swim, but we're saving ourselves until the weather's a bit nicer. One of the uh, interesting things we just got told, ah! that was the thrusters as we were turning around. And what I was gonna say is the boat was actually built out there. That's, that's, the, that's the yard. We've only sailed maybe an hour down the coast from Split. So our next spot is, uh, is uh, Makaska. But look at this water, crazy blue. don't even think this is real life. Just take 10 seconds and just look at this. It just, it, we're actually speechless. Antonio on the bus, uh, on the boat, sorry. 
gave us a recommendation on a place that we had to come. All the footage that you've just seen of this random boat, these like fishing nets, this like hustle in the middle of this uh, like table with like fish on it and noodles and everything has, has led to this. We had no idea. He could have given us a briefing as to how it works. So we walked onto, the, onto this uh, boat here. Uh, apparently great local traditional cooked food, uh, food. So you have to work your way around the table and they give you a plate, you point at what you want, you get it, you pay, and then you're sorted. So that's where we are right now. But McCasker, like, it, it looks like a painting. It's not real. It's just this, this setting, this stunning setting up here. Anyway, I'm gonna try some fish here. Mm. Melts. So much flavor, but only like grilled fish. So much flavor here, and then we got a crispy one as well. I won't bother trying that. Happy. What can we say? This is like... So we haven't really done any like droning, any swimming or anything today, but because we've got seven, probably six or seven more videos, stay around for those. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll catch you in the comments.